What is going on guys? We are right back here for episode number seven in that last episode we played our first NFL games in our career with the Chicago Bears and in this episode we're gonna play more games one episode per uh, One game per episode. That's not enough. I'm gonna give you at least two an episode if not three and Def sometimes I'll give you four, but that might just be make the video way too long and I'm gonna click continue So it should stay at all Madden, right? I would think I would hopefully think that it would either way it is actually gonna be simulating a lot of the regular season because that's like the new face of the franchise mode so it is definitely gonna be interesting but it's simulating a lot of stuff right now I don't know why so here we are um we're gonna have to, gonna have to upgrade our back and I am going to do um elusive back to upgrade ourselves we are up now to an 83 overall and yeah now we're in 84 and i have realized with this new so i can always switch back to the old franchise mode um but and like play every game because with this new franchise mode it adds the press conferences but like it's not letting us play every game we've only played one game and now we're 10 and 0 first in the division um which i don't quite understand why it's like this but that's just how it is is i keep upgrading our player it is like kind of a moment thing you only have to play the moments so i just did upgrade our guy um elusive back and uh, receiving back a little bit so yeah that's it's kind of interesting how we're only playing some games if you guys don't like this i can always change it but for now um we've played one game out of the first 10 and our team is 10 and 0 that's not realistic at all but we'll see what happens so the team's alive in the playoff race you're in you're a serious rookie of the year contender with a tough packers team awaits how are you going to win team effort obviously we need a balanced attack offensively we've got so much talent on the side of the ball and when we are unpredictable on a down-to-down -down basis we are really tough to stop i agree so our team is ready plus 10 awareness to all offensive teammates for the next game tough test ahead your balanced offense is about to meet up with a well-prepared d plus 10 player recognition to all opposing team defenders for the next game well that stinks and prove you're the man gain 175 rushing yards we'll see so as the game is loading up here, I really want to know your opinion. Do you like this new franchise? Like, I can always switch back to the classic franchise where I play every single game. But it's like, this franchise, I played the first game of the season, and the next game I don't play until our 11th game of the season, which I believe is week 12. And it's just like, it's nice and all, but it's just, it's just skipping so many games and things like that. But either way, it's only our second game of the season that I am actually playing. And I should be the first one on all Madden difficulty. And we're against the Green Bay Packers, who uh, are my favorite team in real life. So it's going to be hard to win this. Um, but that's just how it works. It's only our second game I'm playing of the season. And I guess our team is somehow 10-0, despite us being the Chicago Bears, which does not make sense at all. And, um, okay, um, I don't even know what I'm doing at this point. So first and 10 here. Let's see how this goes to start off. Going to hand it off to myself. And uh, not a good start at all. Second and nine here. Once again, they're going to hand it off to me. I'm going to try to get something, and oh my gosh, can you help offensive line? So it looks like it's third and 12 here, and I'm going to have to be running like a fly route here. It's going to definitely be interesting. I'm going to snap it here, looking, firing, and what's happening? There's a flag. Something's going on. A legal block in the back by the offense. Me? What? Wait, what? Okay, but it's third and 10 still. Well, it is going to be 3rd and 10 here. It's going to be a very hard 3rd and 10 because this Packers team is not messing around so far. And they're going to fake the handoff to me and wide open across the middle's court. Nope, he dropped it. Never mind. So 4th and 4 now. We are going to be getting a punt so the Packers did not score and neither did we. And yeah, uh, here we go. Um, let's try to capitalize because on that last drive it did not go well. And it's going to be a long way to the end zone as we start down at the 6-yard line. So, 1st and 10 here. It looks like they're going to be handing off to me on this 1st down play. And I'm getting absolutely nothing. This is a terrible game. So, it looks like it's 2nd and 10 here. I'm going to hand it off once again to myself. And just, I can just cannot get anywhere with this offensive line. It's almost like the difference between like an easy skill level and a hard skill level is not just like you and how hard it is for yourself, but like just how your uh, the team plays. Um, but it's going to be third and six here. Um, they are going to pass it to me. Look at that. 
So I was taken off there for first and ten to get some rest, but it is going to be second and two here. I'm going to get my reps right on back. Second and two, I find the hole. First down, moving the chains. That's what we like. Taken off once again for another play, and the Bears do go ahead and get that first down, which is nice without me on the field. And now I'm right back on the field, ready to go. Trubisky's going to pass it to me out of the backfield. I'm trying to get past people, and I only get two yards. I definitely messed up my skill moves on the last play, which definitely messed it up here. But it's going to be second and eight here. I'm just going to be blocking. Looks like I'm going to have to come up against Zedarius Smith of all people. It's going to be second and eight. I'm going to try to double team. Looks like he's found Jimmy Graham, the former Packer, who's going to get only three yards. So it's going to be third and four now. Huge play at this point in the game. I'm just going to be running like an out route here as everyone else goes into the middle for slants. And Trubisky is going to throw to me. And I cannot quite get that first down. So close, though. It's back-to-back -back plays. I was not in the game. But now they're going to put me back in here on second and four. Obviously, a slower start than the last game, but it's a higher difficulty. Because for some reason, there's a glitch in the last one. Makes it more realistic. So second and four. Now Kenny Clark gets right past their offensive line. I kind of avoid him, but I run into a Packer wall. So third and two. Now they're going to take me off once again on this like set of plays here, kind of in a row. Let's see what they do. David Montgomery is going to be the running back. Trubisky drops back. Trubisky is scrambling. You're never gonna get that, Trubisky. Like, what are you doing? Um, what just happened? We just somehow got a touchdown on that drive after it was fourth down. I have no idea how. I don't know if we did a fake field goal or what. But we just got a touchdown somehow. The Packers did respond, though, at three points. But right now, looking good for us. Okay, so I definitely want to step up the game here. It has kind of been a rough game for me. It has been completely terrible. It's been rough, though. It's first and ten here. Trubisky's going to hand it off to myself. And it's just, wow, the Packers are just get to you way too fast. I mean, some of these Packers linebackers and defensive linemen are just insane. Kenny Clark, Zedaria Smith, and even their middle linebackers. They're playing out of this world right now. It's going to be second and eight, though, for Trubisky. Trubisky, and maybe I should have helped them block there. Third and eight here. I'm going to be running like an underneath route, so I'm probably not the ideal target here, but we will see what happens. And it looks like I'm actually going to get the Trubisky. Trubisky. I'm calling for the ball. I'm wide open. I got space in front of myself, and you can't make the throw. Come on, Trubisky. You got to help out. Okay, good for us. The Green Bay Packers, they did turn over the ball, which is generally rare because they have Aaron Rodgers. Maybe it was like a fumble or something like that we are going to flip the play here it's going to be first and ten we're kind of running like a curl route which is kind of a really bad route in this scenario but we'll see what happens i do call for the ball as i improvise and change my route and we only get a couple of yards okay i won't be surprised if i don't touch the ball that much for this drive coming up or this whole entire drive because it's second and seven right now and we need to get like a lot more yards because we need to go 59 yards down the field we only have 46 seconds so we'll see what happens um trubisky's looking and Tr trubisky trubisky uh, why are you fumbling? Luckily, our offensive lineman picks it up. So it's going to be third and eight here. We got three people running deep. Empty backfield. I'm going to kind of be running like a flat here to the left, and we'll see what happens. 38 seconds to go. We only have one timeout, so it's key to get something from this drive. Trubisky's looking. He's going to look deep, and a flag on the play. Is that pass interference? Let's see. Oh, <gasps> yes. It's going to be second and ten now. Uh, big play once again here. I'm going to have to block Zedaria Smith. And look at me blocking, man. And we get a decent amount. Okay, we just used our last time out, and there's only 24 seconds. So we got to take a shot to the end zone here, or we got to um, do an out route. And I'm actually going to be running a wheel route here. Let's see what happens. Going to find Miller over the middle. We got to hurry up. We got to hurry up. We're at the two-yard line. Time's running out. Last play of the half. Can something happen here? Going to look. Firing. Incomplete, but we got three seconds. So, they take me off for the last play of the half. Because I think they're just going for the field goal, and they do. And the Packers have to uh, punt it away here, which is going to be incredible. And, you know, this could result in possibly something. Um, we are up 10-3, to and we're getting the ball right on back. Maybe a chance to make our lead huge against the Packers. So I will definitely say this is like a defensive team first type of game, opposite from the Lions game. Guys, I am having a rough day out, but we'll see what happens here. First and 10 here. Um, it's going to be slants. I'm going to be running out to the left. We'll see if I actually get targeted the ball. Trubisky's going to look across the middle. Flag on the play. Is it pass interference, holding, or what? And it's going to be holding on the offense. Well, that's a double negative. So it's going to be first 16 here, and I'm kind of uh, running like a coral route in a sense here, but I have options when I get to a certain part of the field. So so I'm just going to kind of stand around here and Miller will get a catch for a decent amount. I'm going to be second and two here. I'm going to be running out to the right and everyone else will be like running kind of slants in a sense. We'll see what happens here. Second and two and I'm not open. And what's Trubisky doing? 
Trubisky's running for it, and Robinson, block for him, man. He could've got the first down. So we're doing like a power type play to the right, which is not ideal because we're running like right into Kenny Clark and Zedaria Smith, and I'm not even a power back. We'll see how this goes on third and inches, and I kind of cut it back to the left, breaking off people, and the first down, moving the chain. We only have eight rushes for 19 yards in this game. Definitely different than that first game we played, but either way, it's gonna be first and 10 here. They are gonna hand it off to me. I'm looking for a hole, and I only get one yard. So they're going to be running like a stick type play here. Trubisky's going to look, find Allen Robinson, but he cannot hold on. Third and eight here. Big play to continue the drive. It's going to be four verticals. I'm not really running like a route that's going to get a first down. So yeah, I'm just going to kind of stay in the back here. Trubisky's under to pressure. Kind of gets through. I'm getting knocked down. Trubisky does slide, but it's not enough for the first down. So the Packers do go down to score and get three points, but I mean, they haven't gotten a touchdown yet. Low scoring game, 10 to 6. Possibly a chance here to maybe make it like a 13 to 6 or 17 to 6 game to give us more of an advantage, but we'll see what happens as our return goes to just the 25. So it is going to be first and 10 here. We'll see what happens on this drive. First one is going to hand it off to me on trap, and just I cannot get my game going yet. So it's going to be second and eight here. Once again, running slant. So I'm going to be going outside to the left here. Let's see what Trubisky does. Looking in the middle, and it's going to be caught there for a first down by Miller. So I was taking off the field for one play, and we got six yards, and that's going to bring up second and four. I'm going to be running an HB dive on this play, hoping to get some yards up the middle, and I just run into a wall for absolutely nothing. Okay, the last play wasn't absolutely nothing. We got two yards, but it's third and two here. We're going to be kind of doing a similar play. Actually, it might be the same play on third and two, hoping to get that first down. I find a hole that I just cannot get there in time. This Packers defense is way too fast. I don't know what happened. I don't know if there was a turnover or what because there was not a punt because I did not take it. But the Packers are giving us amazing field position right now on first and 10 and we're avoiding Kenny Clark at the line of scrimmage and we're getting 10 yards moving the chains. We've had 14 rushes today for 41 yards, only an average of 2.9 per carry, which is not good. It's going to be first and 10 here. We are going to run slants here after that last first down. Let's see what happens here. I'm going to be calling for the ball on okay um my guy is slipping up and uh this is not good at all we were just picked off and um that could diminish our hopes it looked as if we could have just completely put the game away and all of a sudden trubisky throws a pick six. First and ten now gonna be slants once again Trubisky looking Trubisky not giving the ball to me as I call for it and he's gonna run for only seven So there's gonna be the two-minute warning 13 to 10 Lots on the line for this game I was kind of annoyed that Trubisky ran there because you cannot be running when we need to get more yards than that And I was kind of open but either way second and two now come on gotta be a good last two minutes If we want to win this game it's gonna be second and two Trubisky finds me first down and yep I can't hold on to the ball. I'm not strong enough Third and two. I'm not running any route here. I'm just staying in the back to block. Hopefully I can block. And Trubisky goes quick throw to Jimmy Graham. There we go. Having to quickly hurry up here. We're going four verticals. Gotta hurry up. We don't have much time. We have three timeouts, but we don't want to use it right away. It's going to be first and ten here. I'm actually going to be running here, looking to catch it. Trying to get out of bounds. Did I get out of bounds? I think I did. Yeah, I definitely could have ran forward on that last play for more yards, but saving the clock is what matters. It's second and three now. Going to be passing it again. I'm going to be calling for the ball on the outside. Maybe it was good that I actually dropped it. See what happens. Come on. We got to get this third down. Trubisky finds Miller. There is a flag on the play. I have no idea what it is. Ill no. 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 What? Wait. What did I do? What did I do? I don't know what I did. I just... Okay. I just blew it. If, if, that, if that's the reason why I don't win, it's, it's my fault. It's my fault, guys. If I just... I think I just blew it there. Well, well, it's 3rd and 13. After I thought we had a first down, it's now 3rd and 13. My bad, guys. My bad. Trubisky, why are you running for it on 3rd and 13? Why? The game comes down to this. If we don't get this first down, the game's over. It's dusted. Done and dusted. The Packers win. We gotta get something here. I'm gonna be running a route myself. Trubisky's throwing it up. Oh, it's caught! It's caught by Allen Robinson! Allen Robinson is going! Touchdown, Bears! Less than a minute to go! Oh my gosh! Trubisky threw that up, not expecting that to go anywhere. And somehow, Allen Robinson comes up with it over Kevin King. Oh my and not just that but he runs all the way for the touchdown that could be the sealer if we can just hold on and it looks like we did we have held on to the game not the prettiest game on offense for myself or the team 
but with that we now hold on just letting the clock run down 17 to 13 we win we keep our perfect record going let's go so I will definitely say that Trubisky actually did pretty well in the air, which was what really helped us. But um, not a great game for us at all compared to that other game we actually did play. I was second in rushing yards. Aaron Jones did pretty well. I had only 41 yards on 14 carries, so an average of only 2.9. And on the receiving end, I did have 5 for 26, but that was only a total of 67 scrimmage yards on 19 touches. Not that good at all. We are 11 and 0 right now. So we just played two games in the regular season only. Only two. Like maybe not play all 16. Give give us at least like eight games. But we played two games and now we're in the playoff divisional round against the Green Bay Packers. So we've already played. Like you've only given us two games, man. It's like seriously, only two games, really? Okay, I don't really understand. But in just two games, we're already done with almost the whole, the whole first year of the regular season. Like, it just it just doesn't make sense at this point. My player's going up like crazy, which is nice. But, like, the fact that you're just giving me two games to play and we're already in the playoffs and things, that's just kind of insane. So, I don't know. I am kind of tempted to switch back to the normal franchise mode. Not because I don't like, you know, the press conferences and things like that. But it's just, the problem is, is that it's switching to classic would let us play every game or at least you know some games that we actually want to play and it would let us actually look at the stats on the year because we cannot look at that which is like terrible like we cannot look at that we can only look at like these different random highlights like two weeks we've played that's it come on man that's all you're giving us <sighs> i don't know what to think i really don't know what to think but it's just I don't know, do I want to play this divisional one? Because yeah, it's good, but like, the last episode, you guys see me play the first game of the season. You're going to be seeing the title of this video, it's going to be like, playoff divisional round, and you're like, wait, what? Did you just record like 10 episodes in one video? It's just, I don't know what to think, but we are going to continue and see what happens. So they're saying tough break, Jimmy Graham wasn't cleared for contact and is out of the playoff game. Okay, now you tell me this, what did we tell the team? We're going to tell them great teams persevere. Great teams persevere despite their setbacks, and that's what this team will do. We're not just one guy. One guy. There's 51 other men that got us here, and together we will prove we are the better team. Losing him was a major blow to our playbook. But we wouldn't find out just how much of an advantage it was to our opponents until we were facing them. I really don't know how to feel. I'm going to keep talking about it, but I don't know how to feel playing two games. I mean, I guess it's maybe fine to play like, you know, six, seven games, but like just two games. I mean, I will say we're going to get through our career fast. I mean, if you're giving me like two episodes for one season, we're going to get through our career super fast. And I have no idea how we even leave the Bears team. Like, I don't know. I'm really kind of tempted to switch to back to classic, but at the same time, I'm not. It's just kind of all up in the air. So you guys tell me if you actually want me to switch back to classic. Because, I mean, last episode, you see me play my first NFL game, and now here we are in the next episode, and we're playing a divisional game. It's in the middle of January and snow against the Green Bay Packers. And we all, we're only playing against the Green Bay Packers. We played two games against them and one against the Lions. It's like... I don't know what to think. I mean, it will make us progress to the series, so maybe we can get n not just this series in, but maybe like a second wide receiver series in. I don't really know what to think, but yeah, we're just going to go with it. We're going with how this is. If you guys really want me to change it back to the normal franchise mode, maybe I won't play every game, but I'll like sim, you know, like half of them and play eight. But we'll just see what happens. So it's given us the goal of scoring three plus touchdowns in our playoff debut. They're overhyping us. I mean, okay, we, yeah, we're insanely good. But they're t like they're acting like, oh my gosh, we get like three touchdowns, 500 yards a game. I mean, the last game they're asking us to get 175 yards rushing. It's just way too high expectation. But either way, it's gonna be first and ten here on the first play. They are gonna be throwing it to me on the first play. Don't tell me it's holding. Do not tell me it's holding. Ye Wait, what? Personal foul roughing the passer. Okay. Okay. I'll take that bad boy Kenny Clark So after that last play here is gonna be first and ten looks like he is going to hand it off to me Trubisky I'm trying to break tackles and I get seven yards two good plays to start off the drive here It's gonna be second and three not gonna be handing it off to me I am running a route to the left here, but I don't know if I'm really the primary target on this play Trubisky's looking looking for someone and wide opens Cordell Patterson and we're already inside the red zone in just three plays first and ten now inside the red zone come on this is where we can get our touchdowns this is where we can shine this is where we become a hero and we're trying to
to use our speed to get to the outside. We don't get the touchdown, but we're inside the five, and it's another first down. So they just took us off on the last play, and that just slowed the drive completely down. You don't take me off, okay? Number one rule, don't take me off. Second and goal, going, looking for the end zone, and eh, we'll only get one yard. After an insane hot start here, it is kind of hard to finish the drive against the Packers here. It is going to be third and goal. They are going to hand it off to me just three yards away. Can I get into the end zone? I can! Touchdown, Bears. It's a touchdown for myself. Starting off strong on the opening drive for us. And we're taking the lead in the divisional round. 7 to nothing, And the Packers don't even score. Come on. Let's build on that last drive. Let's build on that last drive. Let's get another touchdown here. Let's see what happens. It's going to be first and 10. Looking. I'm open. Give me that. Give me that. Oh, what a catch. Reaching out. Let's go. 22 yards. Moving the chains. So first and 10 now. Gonna be handing it off to myself. I'm looking, trying to get some yards, and I get a good amount. So I'm starting off really strong in this game, and I'm really afraid that the difficulty dropped back down to rookie like it has been all the time. I'm really hoping it doesn't, but we'll see what happens here. Second and three. Uh, gonna hand it off to myself once again, and uh, look at that. Just another first down is too easy. So they do take me off um, for that first play um, on the set of plays here, and it's just gonna go for four yards. It's gonna be second and six now. I'm gonna be receiving a screen pass and that didn't actually really go that well at all so it's going to be third and four here hoping to keep this drive alive let's see what happens i'm going to be blocking i'm going to release trubisky's looking to run himself and look at trubisky juking around people look at him go up to the 11 so first and 10 here 11 yards till that end zone come on come on come on oh i have some space here going Juking people up to the five. Let's go. So they take me off of the field for that last play, and that's going to be third and seven from that eight-yard line, hoping we can get something here. We don't actually need a touchdown. We just need to get to that one-yard line. Let's see what happens here. Trubisky's going to throw it to myself, and should have thrown it a little higher than that so the defender didn't get it. So with that, uh, we do only get three points, but we still have our 10 to nothing lead, which is very nice in this game, and they're going to punt it right on back to us, hoping for a big return here. Actually, we're not getting much blocking. Maybe you guys should have done a fair catch there so they do take me off for that first down play which i feel like they have been doing it more and more often now which is kind of annoying but it's okay we're still getting our reps it's gonna be second and sixth though our first play off this drive looking for something we only get two yards third and four big play to keep this drive alive let's see what happens here trubisky trubisky is under pressure sacked Okay, 83 seconds, three timeouts, we have time to put together a dry here, it's just about actually executing it and making it work, and on this first play here, I'm gonna get only seven. Okay, I don't know what I was talking about, how I got seven, because I actually got five on that play. Second and five, we gotta hurry up, because we don't have much time. Trubisky's gonna throw it in the middle, incomplete, trying to look for Patterson there. Third and five now, big play, come on, we cannot stall out here, we gotta get something here, we gotta get something, looking for myself, I, nope, I dropped it. I dropped it. So it looks like the Packers are going to be going for a field goal here at the end of their drive to possibly tie it up. Let's see what happens here. Crosby for a 50-yard attempt. And he missed it. He's missed it. Wow. Crosby doesn't have the power to get a 50-yard field goal attempt. Okay. Well, either way here, it's going to be first and 10. We only got 22 seconds, so we got to go something deep here. I'm not going to be running that deep route. We're going to see what happens here. Trubisky is going to be rolling out and sliding. Third and six now, only 11 seconds to go, but I am running a fly route here. We got to get something here if we want something on the drive. So I'm going to try to burn past this guy, and we actually find our tight end in the middle, maybe a chance for a field goal attempt. So we did kick a field goal, a pretty long one actually, to end the half to take that 13-7 to lead, and then the Packers could not score at the beginning of their sec second half on their first drive. So now we're going to have it here. I'm just going to call a fair catch to be safe. So first and 10 here for us to see what happens here. Trubisky's going to drop back. Trubisky's looking, kind of throws it to me, and that could have definitely been better blocking because if number 68 blocked, I could have been gone possibly or pretty far down the field. Third and one here, big play to keep this drive alive. Come on, it's going to be a big play, a big drive to get like a bigger lead against the Packers to take control of this game. We'll see what happens here. Third and one, I'm kind of just standing in the backfield. Looks like I think we threw it to the right side, and I think we've caught it. I don't know who has 
but it's a first down. So after that nice first down here, our, the drive keeps on going. This is what we like to see. It's going to be first and ten here on HB dive right to myself, and I only get a couple there. Make it actually four. So I mean, we did start like off super super well in this game with that touchdown, and ever since then we've still been playing well, but not like out of this world. Maybe we can get get to that high caliber again. But it's gonna be second and six here. I'm actually gonna be running a curl route here and. What are you doing throwing that, Trubisky? I'm going to throw it once again from Trubisky. It's third and six. I'm not going to be running anything. I'm just going to be blocking here. Hopefully someone can get that first down. I'm really betting on it. I'm just going to stand here in case of anything. Going to find our tight end, who's the backup for Jimmy Graham, but cannot get the first down. Come on. Let's end this third quarter off nicely. Let's start the fourth quarter off with possibly a touchdown. Let's see what happens here. It's going to be first and ten. Our tight end's in motion. I don't know his name, unfortunately, because I only know Jimmy Graham, our starter. And Kenny Clark is just too fast. Second and ten here. I'm just going to be in the backfield here blocking. They're going to fake it to me. And Trubisky's looking deep here. And you got to hold on to it. Third and ten here. I'm running a fly route. Come on. We got to get something here. We do not want this game to slip away in the playoffs. Come on. I'm wide open, though. I'm I'm wide open across the middle let's go if I have to do it I will first and ten come on here we go pitch to the outside a chance to get something here trying to get and I mean just I'm breaking tackles and things with the blockers gotta help me I get in 12 here come on we gotta get something we gotta get something here if we want to keep this drive alive I'm not going to be blocking. I'm actually running a route here. He does find Miller, but it's only for a small gain. One of the biggest plays yet so far in this game. Third and eight. Come on. Could keep this drive alive. I'm not really running anything or doing much on this play, so that's kind of terrible. Trubisky's under pressure, and he gets sacked. I told you so. They were due for a touchdown. The Packers got it. We're losing now 17-13. to Come on. Let's go. Second and 10. We cannot be dropping passes like that. Looks like Jair Alexander's in the zone. That's just great. Second and 10. Come on. Throwing it to the outside where I am. Boom. First and 10. I'm actually going to be running a fly route here. If I can somehow get past Kevin King, I think it is. Um, but he's kind of playing deep. So we'll see. Oh, looks like he does a quick throw to our backup tight end. Who I still need to know the name, but I don't. And we get a first down. Okay, last two drives have been going well. I will definitely say that. They have been definitely going really, really well. It's just about keep, you know, the, these plays. Got to keep on coming. Got, cannot stop cannot fall down or something like that. It's going to be first and ten. Here we go. I can use my speed. First down. Keep on moving the sticks. Let's go. Okay, two minutes to go. We got all three timeouts. 42 yards until that end zone. And a field goal's not possible. We got to get a touchdown. I know it's possible. It's just about actually doing it. First and ten. Come on. Come on. I'm tri I'm tri I got tripped up, but he finds Miller. Decent, I guess. Okay, we can't keep doing these underneath plays five yards every time because we got to get a touchdown and time is kind of ticking. We're just over 90 seconds of play. Second and five. I'm not blocking anyone yet. Trubisky, why are you rolling out and running straight into freaking Kenny Clark? What are you doing? Come on, third and six. We need something. Need. We need something. We don't want something. We need something. And that's not what we need to do. Okay, last chance. Fourth and six. This is the last chance. I don't know what else to do at this point. Last chance for something. Four verticals. Come on. Give me the ball. <gasps> no, you dropped it. He's dropped it. He's dropped it. I'm wide open in the middle calling for the ball. Throw the deep. And Allen Robinson can't catch it. Yes, he was completely denied. Come on, man. You, I mean, I was a good defense. No, it wasn't. He didn't even touch the ball. Oh, you're kidding. Just give me the ball there. I'm wide open. I was clicking X, calling for the ball. But no, it's not enough. It's not enough. Oh, you know, I thought all hope was lost. All hope is nearly lost. But there's a chance. There is a chance. That's all I can say. There is a chance to come back and win. There is a small chance. Three people running deep. That's exactly what we got to do. Make it four people running deep. And I'm going to change my route. I'm running deep. Trubisky, I'm calling for the ball. Why aren't you throwing it to me? I'm open. People are open. And you decide to run when we have barely any time left and we're in the playoffs. Are you crazy? What have you done? What have you done? There's a flag on the play. Wow. Yay. We got. Look at all those yards we just got. But there's a flag. Holding. Oh my gosh, who the- oh no. Cody, Cody, you just ruined our chances. You, my friend, just ruined our chances. Because of you, we now have no chance to win unless we somehow get something. And we call a timeout. The chances have now gone from, like, 1 to 0. 
What are we doing throwing it eight yards down the field when we have six seconds to play? I do not understand this team. Seriously, we have no time left, yet we're just throw. I don't understand. I mean, why are you throwing it there when we got eight seconds? Why are you holding when I got all the way up to the 40-yard line? And now Stewart's all the way back at the 29 of the other territory. This game's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's simply over. Well, we were outplayed. Let's check our stats. 69 yards rushing and 80. Okay, I got... 150 some yards you know i did my job i did my job i got my our only touchdown i did my job trubisky is your fault your fault your fault well we are upgrading our player i'm actually gonna go power back this time and we're up to an 85 overall 87 with the morale boosters well it looks like that we have made the pro bowl but we're not gonna play it i don't know how to feel about this franchise mode it's definitely very interesting with you know only playing like a couple games and then the playoffs and things I guess it was decent. We made the playoffs. I don't know if we won the rookie of the year. I seriously have no idea. But that's going to be it for this episode. Episode number seven all wrapped up. It is going fast. If you guys want me to slow down the pace so you guys can see more games and, you know, for me to actually play, play the whole season, then I will gladly go ahead and switch it to classic. But that is going to be it for this episode. It is. It was all Madden difficulty the whole time, which is good. Very good. Um, so it did not change, which is good. But that's going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you like the content. Like the video if you like it, because that is what it's for. And I'll see you guys on that next video. Buh bye Trubisky, you are not good enough for the playoffs. You are not good enough to start. I could switch back to quarterback in the high school days, in the early college days, and probably still beat you for the starting job. You're at fault.